Everybody get up, it's time to slam now. We got a real jam going down. Welcome to the Space Jam. Here's your chance, do your dance at the Space Jam. All right. Hello and welcome to another exciting Let's Play. <laughs> Starring me, L1011 Widebody, and my dog Scamper. Hello. Uh, today we're going to be playing uh, NBA Jam. One of my favorite all-time sports games and um, a very uh, familiar game to most people uh, who spent time in arcades in the 90s where it was essentially ubiquitous and one of the most best-selling um, games, uh, arcade games, and the, uh, the game that um, ushered in the um, arcade type of um, fast-placed... Um, Sports games, uh, which also led to the most noteworthy spin-off being NFL Blitz and its various incantations, or would that be incarnations? I guess I can afford to use the right words. Um, so today we're going to be playing the version that I played the most, which is the Sega Genesis version of NBA Jam Tournament Edition. Um, so let's go ahead and get right into that. Sega. Do, 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 do. The NBA and individual NBA members are copyright of the NBA. Oh my! He's on fire! Iguana Entertainment. He plays basketball like a lizard. There we go. NBA Jam Tournament Edition. Let's take a look at the options real quick. Uh, set timer speed to extra fast. Um, set drone difficulty to extra hard. That'll be fine. Uh, let's turn tag mode on. Let's see, shoot is A. Okay. Let's see, special features. Uh, leave tournament mode on. Oh, five seconds jog clock. Hot spots, power up icons, and juice mode. I'll show you those later. So I think the way that I'm going to break this up into your initials. Sure. Um. L. Ten. Oh, I do not exist. Ah, uh, let's see. Who should we be? Um. So. Um, what year is it? 94, so, um, this doesn't include, um, Vancouver and Toronto. Uh, let's see. Let's be, um, let's be Seattle, because they no longer exist. Tonight's matchup, Supersonic versus Maverick. I don't remember if you can do the... That might be... I might have accidentally disabled that, but you could do... You can put in all kinds of extra modes. If I can remember how to jump. Yeah, look at that! Coming in from the side, it's Sean Kemp! So, let's see. NBA Jam. Ah, You loser. Eat that! Oh, come on! Oh, no way! Oh, okay, so NBA Jam basketball, I'm pretty sure I've mentioned it at least a few times, is not one of my favorite sports. Whoops. Um, so I really had no interest in basketball until um, I uh, played NBA Jam for the first time in an arcade. Yeah, there you go. And um, it was it was just really it, well, it looked like a lot of fun, obviously. So I went ahead and um, played it. And, uh, later on, um, I had a friend uh, who had a, a Sega Genesis, and the port, I believe, the Sega one was the first. Whoop. That's not what I wanted to do. Boom, shakalaka! Um, 
It was one of the first ports. This was game was ported to a ton of systems. Uh, but if I remember right, the Genesis one was the pretty much the most popular. Oh, I didn't even realize the sh the, the uh, period ended. Oh, uh, let's see, accurate jump shot. Until defender's out of position, I uh, don't tell me how to play. So, um, one of the neat <laughs> deadlift strength. Hell's yes. Um, so NBA Jam was pretty straightforward. You uh, picked a team and um, the um, just it's a two on it's a yeah two on two uh, basketball game without any um, without pretty much any rules. Uh, I believe the only rules are um, the shot clock and goaltending. Ah. Oh. No! And, uh, let's see. It kind of, it started the whole, a whole genre of, of super arcade type sports games. Uh, it was made by Acclaim, who, uh, previously, uh, did, um, Arch Rivals. Which was another pretty, pretty fun basketball game, um, that was reasonably popular in the arcade. Uh, but I always remember playing it on NES. Damn ball, Shrimp. Come on, white boy. Ah, oh, puts up a brick. Ah, oh, you guys are worthless. No wonder you moved to Oklahoma. Oh, jeez. I'm only up by one. And that's not gonna help. Come on, get it in the thing! There we go. Uh, Arch Rivals was kind of a was a fun game. No! Oh, I can't believe that happened. Um, where it was kind of uh, loose. Uh, it like this. It was it was loose in rules, and um, the big the big kind of uh, selling point to uh, Arch Rivals was the fact that you could. Punch opponent opposing players. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Oh no! No! Come on! So NBA Jam was kind of uh, an extension of that. Obviously, it's a lot more um, into the whole kind of showboating aspect that the NBA is kind of famous for. Now, are you going to make every single goddamn three? There we go. Ah ha ha! Goaltending, like I said. Um, and NBA GM Tournament Edition added, well, uh, tournament mode, obviously. <sighs> Come on, shrimp. What? Put it in the damn thing! Come on! Jeez! You shoot like a girl! Oh! <laughs> Get the ball! Come on! There we go. Um. So let's see what else. So uh, the tournament edition, I added uh, tournament mode, obviously. Put it in the. <laughs> God damn! Clutch attribute. Whatever. Um. It also added. Who is good at three pointers? Any of you? You are all worthless. Uh, it also added um, roster substitutions and expanded the rosters from. from the outside. You have missed every single three pointer in this game, haven't you? Um, expanded the rosters from uh, two to like anywhere from three to five players. So and now players would get injured. So as you notice, you get to shove people pretty freely. Ah, bogus man. 
from the outside. Yeah, there we go. Um, let's see. The rebound. No good. What was that? Die. Oh, you dunk like a white man. <laughs> um, jeez, what else do I have to say? Um, other than I'm about to lose. Hey, look at that. So obviously the emphasis is on big dunks and stuff, and I should probably have picked somebody who was a bit better at it than... Well, Sean Kemp was pretty good, I guess. I think he has an eight in dunking. So the high, higher your dunk rating is, the better you do. If the more impressive uh, jams you can do. Yeah, fine, do that. Like that. That's pretty cool. Hit him! Hit him! What? 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 You guys are bastards. <laughs> oh, you don't get to do substitutions in overtime. And you can do layups when you grab the rebound, which is kind of cool. Come on, steal it! Why are you so much better at three-pointers than I am? There we go. Who said white men can't jump? Wasn't that the really, really bad basketball game that Sean Baby hates so much? It's based on the movie or something. I don't know. There we go. Now we're getting it done. Uh, let's see. So, a little bit of strategy besides falling down. Aw. Um, holding down... Turbo makes you do better stuff. Ah! Oh. No, don't let him do that. Go get it. Yeah, look at that. Uh, turbo makes you run faster, and it makes you jump more. And I think you need to have it to to do dunks. Yeah, look at that. He's wide open. And also holding down turbo when you hit the steal button makes him shove. Otherwise he just kind of swipes at the air like that. Oh, puts up a brick. But I won! Yay me! So let's take a look at the stats. can't believe you made three three-pointers. Look at that shit! Five three-pointers, seven three-pointers, lots of injuries, you're all dead. Well, that's kind of stupid. It doesn't show you the stats for overtime. Last play, Dallas won. Game over! So, the way I'm going to break this up, since obviously... There's a lot more fun things in here. Is turn on hotspots and power-ups. Not juice mode. And whoops. And go ahead and play a second game and just kind of show off a little bit. Welcome to NBA Jam. Yay! Last play, Dallas and one. Let's see. Who should we be now? Who is on <laughs> Christian Leitner? Let's see, Houston is good. They got Hakeem Olajuwon and Hori. It's pretty good. Um, Portland was really good at the time. They got Clyde Drexler and David Robinson. And um, Porter, whose name, I don't remember his first name. He was really good at three-pointers. And um, this is usually the team... Um, that I picked. Uh, me and my friend actually went through uh, playing two-player. 
uh, trying to beat the whole game. And Portland is usually the team that we use because they're really fairly balanced. The Except I apparently picked the really short guy to... Four points! So Hotspots adds um, little hotspot icons on the uh, court. Oh, you can't steal! And if you make uh, a basket from there... Whoops! No! What are you doing? Oh, that was the lamest rejection ever. Heh <laughs> the can be Matumbo. Oh! Three pointers. Yeah, you're a whole lot better at three pointers, aren't you? Get the damn ball! Ah! Oh, you loser. Um, so, and also there are these nice power ups. Whoops! Oh, that's the bomb. Uh. So there's a couple of different power-ups. He's on fire! You know, I didn't get anybody on fire in my first game. That was the whole kind of really cool um, selling point about the game. If you make, um... Boing! Oh! If you make, um, three consecutive uh, baskets... ...and the other team doesn't... Um, then you get to be on fire and you have unlimited turbo and, and the guy is all glowing and the ball is on fire and you can't make really easy shots that any moron should be able to make. Clutch an attribute. Why are you so excited about that? Let's put in, uh, David Robinson. I almost said Denard Robinson. Ugh. <laughs> oh. Let's see. What are the other ones? I know there's, there's three pointers, which is what he's got right now. Oh, he's stuck. Oh, uh oh, what's going on? I'm gonna have all kinds of trouble with my controller all of a sudden. Just get some something in the net. Come on. Uh, let's see. Three pointers. B is the bomb. How exciting was that? T is unlimited turbo, which is really cool. But it's not like being on fire. When you're on fire, you can... I think you can goaltend freely. Get up! What? That's some shit right there, man. Oh, whatever. Uh, P is increased power, I guess. Uh, finally! God! Oh, I see. I keep forgetting who I am. Go get the ball! For eight points! Oh! Uh -huh! That could have been more exciting. Let's see. What other games were there like this? Aw, oh, fuck you! What? Run away! What? Come on! He's not even touching it! You guys are bastards. I don't know. I don't even remember what I was saying. Something about something. Oh! Other games like this. So, um... Like, like the most well-known, um... Kind of, for lack... Well, no, I guess they are sequels. Um, was... NBA Hang Time. For seven points! Yes! Uh, and NBA Showtime. And I can't remember what the difference between them was. Oh, wait, I remember. Uh, Hang Time was uh, more or less like a straight sequel. And then... Yes, six points. And then Showtime uh, was uh, the first one in 3D, I believe. And that one was on... Whoop. Oh, I missed. 
Um, Hang Time was on arcades and uh, the Sega Genesis. Uh, and Showtime was on arcades and in. Um... Oh, come on! Pass it back! Oh, I wanted that eight pointer! Um. What else? I think it was on. I know it was on the uh, Nintendo 64. Oh, it expired just before I scored! Um, I believe it was also on the Dreamcast, and it might have been on the PlayStation, but I can't remember. Ah! Oh! End of the third quarter. Secret power-ups! Try special controller and bat button moves during the tonight's matchup screen. Now, I don't remember what any of those are, unfortunately. Or well, I would have used some. All my guys are getting broken. Um, uh, let's see, what else? What? Why are you on fire? That doesn't count. Um, I might do, uh, Showtime. Showtime was pretty cool. Um, I might do that one later. God, come on! Why won't you score? Get out of my fucking way! Aw, oh, blow me! Up yours. Finally, Christ. Oh, don't let the ball fall down on the ground. Uh, oh, I missed the four pointer. Eight points. Gimme, get out of my way! I need it! Get in there! You son of a bitch! Get the ball in the thing! You guys are dumb. What the hell was that? Aw, oh, how come that didn't count as a four pointer? Rejected! And then you did absolutely nothing with it! For four! Shoot! Oh! I still won. <laughs> oh! For some reason I thought I was behind. So there you go, that's uh, NBA Jam. Let's see, what else? It was ported to. Um, I believe it was on the Super Nintendo and the Genesis. And I think it was on, like, the Jaguar, and the Game Boy, and the Game Gear, and pretty much any, any, uh, early mid-90s console. And then there were some sequels, and some newer ones that came out. Uh, now, um, Electronic Arts owns the, um, rights, and they came out with a sequel recently. But anyway, that's it. There you have it. NBA Jam Tournament Edition on the Sega Genesis. And until the next time, I will see you around.